Yes, a man's body is found in a drainage culvert on the city's west side. But what happened next involving two teenage girls is even more disturbing. Eyewitness News reporter Alyssa Day spoke with the man's family, fighting to honor his memory. With a smile like no other, family members say 25-year-old Marcus Adams was well-loved. He enjoyed being outside and staying active. Because his attitude and how he'll make fun. A kind person and the oldest of six, his mother says he kept everyone laughing. He'll, he'll do anything. And they just automatically loved him because, like I said, his attitude was just, he kept a smile on his face. On Monday, Adam's family received devastating news. The Bear County Sheriff's Office says Adam's body was found in a drainage culvert in this far west San Antonio neighborhood. The medical examiner has ruled Adam's death a suicide. But what happened after he died has the family questioning everything. It's bad enough to steal from the living, but to steal from the dead, he's helpless. Sheriff Javier Salazar says teenage girls who discovered the body recorded cell phone video of the incident and of them stealing a necklace from the body. Oh, they're, they're laughing about, I can't believe you're doing this, words to that effect, treating it as a joke. The family says what happened was insensitive and cruel, but they will fight to honor the memory of the man they love. And we just want justice for Marcus Adams because we feel, we don't feel what is being said about him. And while their grief is overwhelming, they say they are grateful to everyone who has reached out to comfort them. Marcus Adams was loved. Mm -hmm. He had a family. A large family. In the meantime, at kens5.com, you'll find a link to a fund the family has set up to help pay for funeral expenses. Alyssa Teas, Kens5 Eyewitness News. Now, the two girls accused of stealing the jewelry are 16 and 17. The 17 year old is charged with theft from a human corpse and grave. She's been released on bond.